Steven Spielberg has spent his career mixing popular blockbusters with Oscar fare. Sometimes, he has been able to combine the two into one movie. Saving Private Ryan is one of those films. It's a war epic with massive star power, perhaps the last war film to also serve as a real crowd pleaser, even if it was also brutal at times. Here are some facts you might not know about Spielberg's Saving Private Ryan. Screenwriter Robert Rodat was given the book D-Day, June 6, 1944, The Climactic Battle of World War II by Stephen Ambrose. In addition to being a big book for Collins, it also helped inspire Rodat, along with a monument he saw to lives lost in various wars. There was a family, the Nillans, mentioned in Ambrose's book that gave Rodat the hook about multiple sons from the same family in World War II. Rodat pitched his idea to producer Mark Gordon, who pitched the idea to Paramount. There was no script at the time, but Paramount liked the idea and commissioned a script from Rodat. Once the script was finished, Spielberg and his agent read the script and liked it. Spielberg agreed to direct it, and no other director's name was ever attached. Prior to making Saving Private Ryan, Spielberg had already directed 1941, Empire of the Sun, and Schindler's List. Heck, even two of the Indiana Jones movies have World War II connections. Clearly, Spielberg had an interest in the subject. When casting his film, Spielberg said he wanted to cast actors who would look the part. Specifically, he believed that people during World War II looked different than people in the 90s. In short, Spielberg wanted the cast to match the faces I saw on the newsreels. These days, Spielberg and Hanks are tied together. In addition to their multiple films, they produced two World War II TV shows together, Band of Brothers and The Pacific. While Hanks said he and Spielberg had wanted to work together, Saving Private Ryan marked their first project together. When making a movie on a grand scale, you can't merely settle on one actor you want and hope for the best. In addition to Hanks, Harrison Ford, Mel Gibson, and Pete Postlethwaite were considered for the role of Captain Miller. Rising star Edward Norton was the first choice for the role of Ryan, the soldier that Miller's entire squad is pressed into finding and saving so that he can be sent home on account of the fact all his brothers have died in battle. However, he turned down the role for a larger starring role in American. 